Hi everyone, Liz here. Thanks for stopping by. So, I've got a new package today with some lovely new items to show you. And these have come to me from the good people at paintsomeway.com. Uh, yeah, I've been uh, showing their products for quite a while now and loving everything I've had. So, I'm excited to have a look in the new one. And I just thought I'd quickly show you a few completions that I've got done. I'm cracking along with my Easter things. Look, because I want to get them all up on my Easter display. So, hasn't that bunny come out absolutely gorgeous look at his sparkle and that little face that was the bunny that had the really strange eyes if you remember because he didn't have his eye uh, his gems in his eyes and because of the numbers it just looks like he was staring but he's come out very very cute now <laughs> i had to put the eyes on straight away and uh, then i've done the little mo cow look as well the little highland coo and yay that one's really pretty and sparkly as well and he's got easter eggs so he needs to go up on my easter display uh at the moment i've got uh, like a gonk wall and a bunny wall so i'm not quite sure where he's going to live we'll have to see where we've got a space i think <laughs> Uh, if you're wanting to see the full unboxings on those and all the full measurements and detail, the Little Bunny and the uh, Highland Coo came in my February unboxing. So if you check out Paint Somewhere's playlist, down in my playlist, I think it's up there, it says playlists. And then if you just scroll down, sorry, I have got quite a few, uh, you will find Paint Somewhere and it will be in there. And then this one from a January this year playlist is my little owl mirror. Uh, it all needs putting together. I've not taken the covers or anything off those yet, but I have done all the gems. So it does need sealing as well. So I'll have to crack on with that. But yeah, I will do a full completion review like uh, kitting down on those. Uh, so watch this space. That will be coming soon. One of them does have gem codes, the other one doesn't. So, yeah, that will be fun to do as well. But let's get on to the main event. We have some new products. So, huge thank you, Paint Some Way, for sending me these. Uh, at the moment, we have, if you buy four items, you'll get one free. And there is 5% off. And if you spend over $49, there is free shipping. So that's round about the £40 mark. So uh, if you're anything like me, that's quite easy to do. So what I tend to do if I'm looking through websites is add quite a few different bits and pieces to my basket or a lot of the or to my wish list um, and then when there's special offers on and things uh, or there's a certain amount for postage I save it all up until I've got that amount and then uh, order it all at once so I tend to get quite a bit at once when I do my big orders but yeah I've always been like that I like to get special offers and I like to save money and <laughs> okay so let's see what we got this time oh we have a painting oh different different dark painting and we have a very bright sparkly painting and we have oh look look i can see your bunny yay look at that little face there oh when i saw these i thought these are so gorgeous i've just got to get them so we'll look at the uh, paintings in a moment but let's have a look at these so this is a special drill project. It's six piece double sided special shaped diamond painted keychains. And they were on special offer at $7.35, which will probably be around about the £6.10, £6.20 ish mark. Uh, it depends on the conversion rate at the time. Yeah, these are definite cuteness overload. Oh, we'll have a look at those in a second. So, yeah, all crystal gems. Very nice and sparkly. And pen bow and wax and lots of little keychains. So, let's just get these out as well. Okay, it's just your basic single place of pen. Oops. So, we've got one, two, three four five six lobster claw clasps so called because they look like a lobster claw ang, 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 ang. <laughs> and then we've got one two three four five 
six little chains as well so you just literally put the chain through your key ring and put it through the lobster claw clasp really easy to do and they're definitely the easiest type to use and i love these i just wish sometimes that they came in a different color as well as just the gold but very very good now i need a grip seal bag to put those in and can i find one can i heck so we'll just put those on <laughs> And we'll put these back in here. Yep, still tidying out my craft room. But I have more or less got everything where I need it to go now. It's just that everything's sort of like out in a pile. So like I've got paperwork. And what I want to do is go through that and sort it before I just put it all back away. And Yeah, and I've got piles of bits that I think, right, that all wants to go in there. But I want to sort it out before I put it in there. So yeah, that's why I can't find my plastic bags. That's my excuse and I'm sticking to it. <laughs> Anyway, back to the cute bunnies. They're all wrapped up for like winter and spring look. Because at the moment, we are definitely, sometimes it's a spring weather and then the next minute, you know, you need your woolly pulley on because it's so cold. The wind is really, really cold at the moment. So he's a little brown bunny look with a little pink hat on and a little pink scarf. And then, oh, look at this one. Oh, <laughs> So this one's got like a little white and pink scarf on and it looks like a white possible hat. Both of the ears are out, but look, he's got a very worried expression on his face. And you can see this one's little paws. Oh, aren't these gorgeous. They're definitely very, very cute bunnies. I'll have to get these done so that I can get them up um, on my Easter tree. I think they're going to have to go out for Easter and then I'll just probably keep them out on my tree as well for spring. And that one's a little bit different colours. Looks like we might have a blue or something in that one as well. Oh, the faces are just so pretty. Oh, look at that one. She's very, very cute. Oh, look, and we've got little paws as well. I love seeing the little paws. I think bunny paws are so cute. And then this one. Oh, look, we've got wrapped right round. You should have put your ears inside it as well to keep your ears warm. There's nothing worse than when it's really, really windy and cold and it gets your ears. Whoa. <laughs> it's making me cold. Think about it. Thinking about it. So, yeah, you've got a little uh, head warmer there as well with a bobble hat on. And then, oh, look. That one looks really sad. It obviously doesn't like the cold at all, that one. A very sad bunny. We don't want a sad bunny. We'll give you a little bit of a... A stroke oh look don't you just want to pick them all up and cuddle them they're all double-sided as well so for seven pound 35 normal price 7.99 so they're gonna work out um in in pounds they'll work out to about a pound each so if you were wanting to like sell them or whatever at craft fairs i think you'd get a couple of pound for them make some money back on them but they are so cute i'd it's really, really struggle to actually get rid of these. I'm going to have to keep them as decorations. I don't think I'm going to be giving any of these away. Oh, oh, which one's my favourite? I think that one's really sweet. That one's definitely saying, oh, pick me, pick me up and give me a cuddle. That one's got sort of a little bit nearly smiling. But that one just looks so worried. You've just got to have that one and give it a cuddle. Oh, well, that one looks a bit cross, actually. Do you think that one looks a bit cross? I think that one looks a bit cross. Mm. <laughs> How much personality can you get into a little bunny keyring? They're just great. I love them. <laughs> Let's have a look at the colours. See how many we've got. Oh, and we have got gem codes on the bags as well. So we'll be able to do a proper kitty down on this one. And put them all in crystal code order. Excellent. Oh, <laughs> I can't see two parts this one. So we have one, two, three, four. So there are 12 different gem colours. They are all just your standard crystals. Uh, there's no specials on it, but it is still going to be very sparkly. So we've got your standard crystal there. Oh, a lovely bright cherry red. And that one, what colour is that? It's got a little bit of a grey tinge to it, that one. And a very pale gold colour. And a little bit of a very pale peachy colour. And a little bit of a, oh, 
sort of ready pinky colour. So maybe a rose colour, I think that one, a rose pink. And that's a pale blue. And that's another pale blue. And like a pale grapey purpley colour there. So they're all very pastely pale colours. Very, very cute. And then what's that one then? I'm struggling to see these, trying to show them on camera and see them as well. I think that one could be a very, very pale pink. Very pale, because it does look silver, but they're not. There is a hint of colour there. And then your little bit of like a honey gold. And that's like a very, even paler gold. And then just a little bit of a deeper gold. So there's going to be quite a few tones on those bunnies. And there are quite a few gems there to put on these. But I suppose they are double-sided. Are we? Yeah. It looks like one side you'll be able to diamond paint fine. And the other side, um, the actual picture is on the underside of the acrylic. So you've just got to be careful when you're doing that. Otherwise, you're looking through sort of a skewed perspective, as it were. And uh, if you don't put your gems on directly on top, then you'll find that if you're doing them on a side, when you actually put it straight up, the gems may look as though they're a little bit wonky, as it were. So, yeah, but that's fine. They're just so cute. Oh, wow. All wrapped up. Actually, they'll go through most seasons. They'd look a bit daft maybe in summer, but they'd be really good on like an autumn tree as well because you do sometimes need a scarf and hat in autumn as well. Bunny's over there for now. So which one shall we look at first? Let's look at the darker one first. And it's not what you think. It is quite different, this one. Okay, it is a 30 by 40. And it's a tree. Okay, oh, not many colours. Gosh, they're big numbers. They're definitely Liz numbers. You can see those from space. <laughs> no, <I'm> kidding. <laughs> so, yeah, pen, boat and wax, your standard little toolkit. Uh, it is only a six colours and we do have DMC or gem codes with it. So that's excellent. And it says, to my wonderful mum. So it's like a family tree kind of thing. Uh, picture well that's what i thought anyway when i saw it just give it a bit of a flatten out it's got a little bit creased it's come a long way so it just needs to be put under something heavy for a while and um, some books or all your diamond paintings if you've got lots <laughs> or in a bag under a mattress or something like that just to flatten it out a little bit before you use it um, there are some ironing videos of canvases and I have got an ironing video as well in my playlist if you want to look for that. I've not flattened that out very well, Liz. So let's give it a quick read. So this at the top says to my wonderful mum. Then we have this gorgeous tree with all the gems on it, which hopefully are going to be very sparkly. And then it says, I love you for all the times you picked me up when I was down, for all the times you traded your warm smile for my frown. For all the times you brushed my hair and tucked me into bed. Right, let me read this as a poem. I started reading it and then I thought, no, it's a poem, so let me yeah, read it properly. So, for all the times you picked me up when I was down. For all the times you traded your warm smile for my frown. For all the times you brushed my hair and tucked me into bed. Or needed something for yourself and put me first instead. Oh, for all the dreams that we have shared and the tears and laughter too. I love you. That actually says mum. With all my heart, there's no one like you. Love your daughter. Now, that is very hard to read. So I may have to do a little bit of tweaking with that. There's no one quite like you. And, oh, does it say there's no one quite? That's definitely quite like you. But that's there. Yeah, that must be an S. That's definitely not an N and an O, is it? I'm going to have to do a little bit of tweaking on this one, I think. I like the fact that they've printed out the poem. That's brilliant. Um, and I love you, Mum. Well, you could always change that so it says Mum. Um, or in Hull, we uh, a lot of people actually say Mam, M-A-M, rather than M-O-A, M-O-M. 
um i wonder why they've decided to do it that way not overly keen on that but as i say i will ha give that a little bit of a tweak but i just thought that was gorgeous just that little bit different um and it does say love your daughter i suppose i could always alter it i mean with that being black i can always find something um, some spare black canvas from somewhere and just cover that over and maybe not even put anything there so that I can read it. Gosh, a pigeon just landed on the window ledge then and looked at me and flew off. Wow, that made me jump out my skin. <laughs> maybe it was after sitting in my tree. Go away. <laughs> oh, dear. Um, and I did think maybe putting our names on it. You know, my brother and my sister and everybody just putting our names on it so that it's like the family tree with us all on. Mm, I could maybe get a silver pen and write them on rather than doing it in diamonds. So, yeah, I just really liked this picture. It's just say, something a little bit different. And I did see it and I thought, oh, that's dark. And then I thought, oh, I'll just love the sentiment on it. I think that poem is wonderful. So, yeah, because my mum is wonderful. So let's have a look at these colours, see what we actually have. So, yeah, just the six different ones. Oh, so we've got the blue in it. So we've got... That's actually not black. That is like a real navy blue-grey colour. That might be the black. What does it say? Oh, 81. I think, is it 72? I think, or 92 is the DMC code for the crystal black. So, yeah, they're not black. They're actually... Actually, that one looks a bit greeny colour. That's got a real dark, jady green on it. Ooh. And then your standard silver. And we've got a little bit of your 5200 white. And then this lovely sort of sea greeny colour crystal. And then some larger silver crystals. So that will be really interesting. I mean, to be fair, because there's not many colours, you could actually do that any colour that you like. So what's, what colours are we doing everything then? Let me just have a look at this. So we know that the big ones are going to be dotted around the tree. That's fine. So, all right. So the the writing at the top there. I mean, we can actually can actually read that to my wonderful. I say it says mom rather than mum. Um, and then at the bottom would be in like this sea green colour. Okay, and number four. So this writing here is in white, and then the other three colours are on the tree. Oh. As I say, I mean, you could do this because there's not many. If you've got some spare gems of other colours, you could actually do this in any colour that you wanted to do it. Uh, number three is the X. So number three is like the branches of the tree outlining the tree. And the other two colours are the darker colours on the tree. So it might be interesting to actually do this as is. And then I can always take the gems off and put different colours if I prefer. But I, I'm not overly happy with that. I don't think that really stands out to uh, read. So, yeah. But we'll have a go. But I'm pleased I got it. Uh, and the price of this one is normally four ninety nine, And with offers, it was uh, $4.59. So about £3.80-ish uh, in pounds. So we've had our to our, my wonderful mum. I just want to rush around now and give my mum a big hug. We'll go on to something else cute. So we've had cute, very sentimental. And we're back to cute again. And the price of this one was $3.99 normally. And it was $3.67 on the website uh, when I put the order in. So let's have a look at this one. Look at this little cute oh look and it's on a pillow oh <laughs> and but wax stand a little toolkit so again 30 by 30 and just 
give it a quick flatten it just needs to be flattened out a little bit this one is 13 different gems and colors and sadly there are no gem codes on it and there's no gem codes on the drills either but we can do a generic kitting down on it once it's done so yeah but look at that little face i think when anything's got big eyes because like children and babies tend to have bigger eyes when they're younger, then things do tend to look really, really cute and you just want to pick them up and cuddle them. Okay, so we've got all these little hearts around as well. I suppose it could be a little bit Valentine-ish or a little bit I love you or even for a newborn baby, a picture for a newborn baby's nursery or something like that. But yeah, this cushion look, it's got all lace and little tassels around it. We've got lots of little hearts and it's got a real little smile on its face. Oh, and it's, even its little horn look is all like rainbow coloured. It's so pretty. Do you think she's a little bit embarrassed look because she's got little pink cheeks? Just a little bit embarrassed saying, oh, how cute am I? <laughs> oh, it's gorgeous. I love it. Oh. I mean, for the price, it's just so silly. You know, you've just got a lovely kit to do. Really good value, these kits, because, you know, it's going to take you a couple of hours to do. And what sort of entertainment can you get for like $3.67, which is about £3, and get a couple of hours entertainment out of it and then have a beautiful picture at the end of it as well. So, yay! OK, let's have a look at these colours. Oh, we've got some hot pink, yay! So, 13 different gems and colours. And we're starting off with a very pale pink and a pale bluey grey and a hot pink, yay! And a limey green. And that's a very dark green, almost grey. And that is a grey colour. It's got a tint of something else. It could be green, I'm not sure. And a little bit darker pink there, not a pale pink, a little bit darker one. And an aqua blue and a lovely honey gold. Oh, and then our specials, we've got the uh, semi-spheres in the red, in a larger size and then a small size. We've got iridescent coated green marquees and we've got hot pink hearts. Oh my goodness, it's a definite Liz canvas. Look at all these hot pink hearts that are going to be around. And she's got them all on her little feet. Look. Oh, hot pink hearts on your feet. Wow. Oh, that is just so cute. Yay, I love it. I love it, love it, love it. It will have to wait until after Easter to be done. Um, I am madly doing Easter things at the moment. Uh, we have passed our Mother's Day here in the UK. Ours is in March. And But I do know that like Australia and America do have their Mother's Day in uh, May. So you've got time to get that one and get that one done if you want it as a Mother's Day picture. I just really wanted it as a, a lovely sort of gift for my mum. I'll put it in a nice frame and everything. And as I said, I did think of putting our names on it. And I may even give her this one because I just think this is so cute as well. But I do have trouble giving things away when they're so cute because I just want to keep them all. But my house and my walls just aren't big enough. <laughs> OK, so we started off with a few completions that I will be uh, doing a completion review and a kitting down on that. So keep watching to see that. Huge thank you, Paint Somewhere, for sending me these fantastic products again. Absolutely love them. These bunnies are just smiling at me and I just can't pick them up and cuddle them. So, yeah, we've had our gorgeous little cute unicorn, our very sentimental but wonderful picture for a wonderful mum with a family tree on it, which is just great. Love that. And then our cute little bunny key rings. Yay! <laughs> okay well i hope you've enjoyed this video if you have as always a thumbs up is very much appreciated any comments or questions in the comments down below and i'll get back to you as soon as i can and if you want to join our little family see some of these completed and see what we get up to next then if you press that subscribe button down in this corner the all notifications bell that pops up you'll be notified when any of my videos come out so you're not gonna miss anything yay okay thanks ever so much for stopping by don't forget to go and check out the special offers on paintsomewhere.com and that's me done for now so i'll see you all again soon bye for now